Okay. Hello. We gaan filmen hoor. Ja. En ja, toen ik do a video of talking. En ja, doe maybe a little few. You know. Who knows? Kind of say stuff. Um, discussing things. Uh, mm. You know, it's like I always have ideas of what I want to say when I'm not on the video. And I don't pre-think these things. I just kind of come up with these things on the fly. Yeah. It's more fun that way. It's more fun. You just kind of think up stuff and just say it. And he's like, what? Well, yeah. I don't know. But I'm in the mood to really say stuff, to really be honest and say, yeah, the world's crazy and people suck. But it's just how people, and then I'm like, nah, I'm not in the mood. I don't have the energy. <laughs> I don't know how people have the energy to do, to say mean things every day, to attack people every day. You know how it's like Democrats, you always see them attacking some political Republican. It's like, how do they get the energy every day to do that? Yeah, but now I hate. That's 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 what I am when I can say things about people because I'm feeling kind of really hateful. So I can say that. So I'm thinking when people, whenever people say those kind of things, it's because they're feeling hate inside. <laughs> it's hard for. I mean, a normal person can't doesn't really attack unless he's feeling some kind of adrenaline or really kind of hate. I feel. You know what I mean? So I mean, when you see those guys attack, saying something about some. It's like, yeah, that's some hate there, man. <laughs> because that ain't normal. <laughs> some people really are serious. I mean, I don't... And I'm thinking I'm hateful sometimes, man. I'm like, I don't know. I'm not as bad as those guys. <laughs> yeah. Occasionally, I get in the mood where it's like, man, you know, like every few weeks or something. I don't know. It's all of a sudden, you're like, oh, man, the world really sucks. People really suck. People aren't that great. <laughs> people like, they think they're great. <laughs> Why? It's like when, people, when someone goes on and does his little, your marriage is great, people are great. It's like, are they though? <laughs> you just try to be positive or something to make yourself feel good about yourself. When you say nice things, it makes you feel good about yourself. It does. You know, when I say mean things about people, it makes me not feel good about myself. So, you know, I'll be like, yeah, people are great. And that makes me feel okay. It feels good. I think there's a, there's a thing where we just kind of, I don't know. You know how things, when we need change, and it's like sometimes we just can't really do it. So, you know, anger and stuff kind of forces us to, drives us to do it, to do things that we wouldn't normally do. Like in protection, like if someone's threatening us, adrenaline pumps, and then we do things that we wouldn't normally do, and say things that we wouldn't normally do. And I think a lot of these people have that. Because something's happening, they feel threatened seriously, and so they say things, and it's the same kind of thing, like a flight of fight response, and that's very interesting, you know. So, but yeah, but occasionally I'll have that. I'll like just kind of, it's kind of like, man, it's just because the same thing happens all the time. It's like over and over, and then you just kind of go, well, but I don't go on about it every day. Thank God, you know. It's like if I was one of those guys who just kind of attack people every day, I think I would just, I think there'd be something up with me I'd be like I need to get some I need to see a, a psychiatrist or something a psychologist need to see a shrink or something going on yeah so I don't think I'm that bad I just think I was you know I'm always a nice person I think I just you know but you just can take only so much you know what I mean and it's like you know yeah the world's full of craziness you just get tired of craziness. You get tired of all this weirdness. Tired of this ingenuous, ungenuous, ingenuous people when they're not really being genuine. Where they kind of just kind of say nice things, but they're not really. They kind of go on about being a good person and caring about people, but they don't really. <laughs> and you know, they, they don't, but they just kind of gotta say it or something, or they pretend that they are. But they attack people. Who they say are evil, but they themselves are evil. You know it is. Or they got serious anger. I don't know. They're evil, but they got some serious anger issues and some hatred to people who hate bad, evil. Maybe it's like if you can attack someone all the time, that's hate. I mean, I don't care if it's like hate towards 
them or who is but you have hate inside you that's it is i mean i can that's the only time i feel that i want to attack people and say crazy things it's because when i get in a, in a hateful mood we all get those hateful moods occasionally like occasionally you know it's like not every day it's like once every few weeks once a month once a year or something you kind of just kind of oh. but when it's every day I mean you got those guys those political guys attacking each other every day it's like the politics brings out the hate in people <laughs> or hateful people are drawn to it <laughs> hateful people who love power that's what it is they want they want their man to win because they want the power it's like watching a game you know like watching gladiators fight and you want your man to win you know and you get angry when your man doesn't win and then you try attacking the other man because you got hate in your heart and you just want to keep attacking that's what it's about that's what it is and you guys are like well we're a good people there you go when you attack other people you don't have a genuine charity spirit terrible spirit you gotta you gotta hate even when you attack people you think are evil you still got hate in your heart you got a hatred for them you got a, you got a hatred for them you got a hatred for other things you just good people don't have hatred in their heart it's like when you even when you you try to change things good people can see you wrong and they can and they want to change it but they don't do it with hate <laughs> they don't do it with a hate in their heart <laughs> Even hate for their enemies, you do it because you do it, and you do it because it's the right thing to do. You just don't have hate drive you. You have love drive you. Love should drive you to change things for the better. That's what you should have in your heart. But you, um, yeah, but that's that's the thing. That's what draws. I think that's what draws people away from politics. They see a lot of these people like put a lot of hate, and it's like, oh my god, yeah, that's just not right. <laughs> That's just not, I know, I get anger, man, I get when you're so tired of things being bad and being it the way it is and then just get angry about things and just want to change it for the better and make the world better, I get that. But, yeah, but there's a way of going about it that just doesn't have to turn you into a hateful, like a hate monger, hate monger, monger, fishmonger. <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah. You know, it's an interesting thing. I thought this is an interesting kind of a uh, subject thingy, but yeah.